Jesus Christ. Nowadays, we have the expression, may nanalo na. <laughs> have you encountered that expression? May nanalo na. Or if you will translate it in English, medyo walang masyadong dating. Somebody won. No? But in Tagalog, yeah, may nanalo na. If you uh, accomplish something, you put it in the internet, in Instagram or Facebook, uh, ay, may nanalo na. Or in a conversation, ah, may nanalo na. Sometimes it's just a little accomplishment, no? but it indicates that, you know, something already happened. In the case of our readings, especially the gospel, pwede natin sabihin na, oh, si Simeon, nanalo na. He lasted until the day came that he encountered Jesus Christ. And you know, this <clears throat> line of Simeon is still being used in our night prayer where he mentioned that, Lord, let your servant go in peace. Your word has been fulfilled. My own eyes have seen the salvation which you prepared in the sight of every people a lie to reveal you to the nations and the glory of your people, Israel. Ang ginagamit namin itong antiphone. And there's always sense of fulfillment. Para bang pag nagnanight prayer ka sa gabi, sinasabi mo na, Lord, okay na. Kahit anong mangyari sa akin. As long as I have seen you, as long as I believe that you are the Lord, you can dispose me anytime. I entrust myself to you because you are my Savior. And more likely, it became the battle cry of many who wants to serve the Lord in the midst of trials and persecution. As I mentioned yesterday, I'm just repeating it in one of my sharing. Hindi ko na matandaan kung dito o sa isang misa ko. Na, you know, it's always that light that Jesus brought. The darkness cannot extinguish it. Because it will shine. It will give hope to all who trust and believe in the ways of the Lord. And as I said, for Simeon, anytime, Lord, now, anytime. But we're not focusing on death, but maybe events in life, but with Jesus in our hearts, we may say that, Lord, I can accept any challenge. I can accept any trials because I know that you're the one. I know that you are here with me. And I believe that in accepting Jesus, it's not only Simeon who will say, ah, nanalo na. Tayo rin. Pwede natin laging sabihin na ako, nanalo na rin ako because I have Jesus with me. Yung sinasabi ni Simeon na a light who was revealed to the nation and became the glory of his people, Israel. Jesus became their glory before and Jesus is still our glory now. Ikaw rin, nanalo ka na rin with Jesus. Amen.